So you're not really sure when to generate versus when to model manually. Not a problem. First, you need to understand exactly what your goals are. Are you doing this for fun, or are you trying to practice to get a job, or what are you trying to specialize in? If your goal is to do 3D as a job, then of course, being able to turn a sphere into a beautiful woman is extremely impressive. But that's not necessarily what the company is going to want you to do. Most places just want the results. They want a high quality model that's compatible with the workflow in a short amount of time. Most of the time, they're not going to require you to start every character from a cube. And the fact is that if the company is really big, then there's a high chance that they have a massive library of base bodies and faces that they will expect you to use instead. I learned this when I was messaging my favorite 3D artist on ArtStation, asking if I could buy the base body that they use on some of the characters for their portfolio, and almost all of them told me that the base body was provided by their company, so they actually weren't allowed to sell it to me. Which surprised me, because I literally thought everyone on ArtStation was just turning cubes into beautiful photorealistic women. As it turns out, nah, they just built it off the company base mesh to save time. So, if you want to make everything from scratch all the time, that's cool, it's really impressive, and it probably makes you a better artist, but just know that's a completely separate skill. But if you are modeling with a specific purpose of getting the finished 3D model as fast as possible, then here is my advice on when to generate or kit bash versus when to model manually. And to put it simply, generate the things you don't care about practicing. If you like hard surface modeling, armor, and guns, and you really have no intention of ever becoming a professional organic human face 3D artist, then generate the organic parts, or a kit bash, or use a base mesh from somebody else. Whatever you're trying to get good at, that is what you should be modeling manually. If you're trying to be an organic character modeler, you probably shouldn't be spending all day perfecting your abilities to make trees, rocks, and floral vegetation. That's where you should spend your time manually modeling. For everything else, Kit bash, base mesh, generate, take any shortcut you can find, and don't feel bad about it. Because when you get to the highest level, a lot of the times, the guys who specialize in hard surface don't really do human faces. The guys who specialize in human faces don't really do environments. The guys who specialize in environments don't really do things like clothing, shoes, and hats. Most people spend their time on their trade and they outsource the rest wherever it makes sense. So that would be my recommendation for you as well. I hope that helps, and as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.